standard. Always something going this, on with it, him. Oh. <laughs> oh, this is funny. This is funny. Hey guys, welcome to the Rainbow Reviews with Panos and Matt. Thank you for joining us. We are reacting to episode six of Kaiju number eight. Yes. Last episode it was a lot of fun. Team building. They're graduating. They're training. Yes. And they were now sleeping at the end and they're under attack. Let's see what happens next. Let's go. Let's go. Ooh, it's in the middle of the night. I'll be like, quicker. Chop, chop. <laughs> You're all too slow. Artillery. Okay, they're bringing in the military. Interesting. Mm -hmm. It's a Honju. It's a Honju. Wow, what is this? It looks like a mushroom. It looks like a base, like it's like a moving fortress. See that there's things around it, no? Yeah, they said like more since this one appeared, more monsters appeared as well. Mm. Interesting, do you think we'll see Kafka transform? Let's Imagine. go! Kaiju alert! <laughs> Kaiju, Kaiju is coming! Alert. Get out of the way! Yes! This looks cool! Mm. Wow, they're all in training, but look at them, they're all out here! Oh, she calls him Kaiju number eight. <laughs> Is he throwing up? Oh my god. No. No. <laughs> Standard. Always something going There's... on with him. Oh. <laughs> oh, this is funny. This is funny. This is funny, and then they're giving us the shit in his hands. Can you imagine? <laughs> no. Ooh, let's go. This looks crazy. This looks amazing. The design of the show is very impressive, don't you think? Wow, it's huge. It looks like a turtle. Hmm. I Spores. thought I told you mushroom. Spores. I wonder what it does. It, it, oh. I think it even grows. Oh. This is giving uh, the last of us cordyceps. <laughs> Next level though. Next level cordyceps. Oh, they're divided in groups. They all look a little destroyed, is it just me? Like a little disheartened. Yes. Wow, I guess scared more than anything. Yeah, I would be scared as well. First mission and then <laughs> this thing appears. Let's go. Oh, cute, Reno. Let's go. <laughs> Have fun, yes. He's, he's hilarious, I like him. Hmm, exactly. Yuju. Okay, so the small ones yeah. are Yuju's. Yeah, the little crabbies. I'll be like, babe, you're late. Chop chop. So hold on. How did the others just jump down? What? I know. Oh. I, I know. Bless you. She's the main event. This reminds me a little bit of uh, ne Neon Genesis Evange uh, Evangelion. Mm -hmm. Evangelion. When they were attacking them from, you know, all areas. The angels when they were attacking. Yeah. They're using artillery as well. This is not going to do anything. But I also want to see where they actually come from. Yes, I want to know more as well. Where they where they appear? The or, the origin. Does he have a weapon? 
What is he doing? No. no. I thought he's about to transform. She's like, get out of She's the like, way. She's like, I'm not wasting a second. Get out of my way. <clears throat> okay. Yes. <laughs> nice. Nice. Let's go teamwork. I hope those ones don't regenerate. <sighs> He's in I mean him and his rivalry. He took one down by himself. Yes. Oh. Nice, Reno is good. <laughs> Iharu is like, mm. oh. He's always thinking about him. Yeah. Let's go. So the green one does more damage? Bah, bah, bah. But then, what kind of weapon does she have? Because it seems like she only has to shoot once and they're already like... Exploding. Mm. Is she salivating? Yes! Look at that thirst! She's like, mm, 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 mm. She hasn't seen them in the shower yet. I love the said Kuga mode. <laughs> it's a fun. It, the show has a fun humor. Yes, he killed one Let's of them. Let's see I mean... if Kaiju Nine arrives and revives them. What's he gonna do? Is that the brain or something? What? Interesting. What? Wow. They can they can spawn new yes, babies. I guess he has a lot of knowledge from like cleaning up all those years, you know? And taking them apart, you yeah. know. Especially the part about okay, the reproduction. Good, you yes. help, but you also need to do a bit of fighting. Yeah. So where is this core, you know? This one's core. I'm not gonna have a weapon, wow, Jeez, could it be like... any bigger? Wow, she is the cannon. This is cool. 96%! Oh, Wow, and she can she can do it because the suit is. Whoa! The core, Look, but the cause is... she missed it. Oh. She gonna hit the core? I guess. Well, oh, that was big. The whole the whole thing is gone. But what if the core is intact? Can it then reproduce? We just regenerate, regenerate. or like. Uh, yeah. Small yeah, yeah. Ones. Oh? Wow. Wow, she's like, I'm gonna destroy the whole thing a few times over. Interesting. Let's see if number nine appears. What is going on? 
She's not trusting it, I guess. Right? She just wants to vaporize it. Is she? What? Wow. Okay, he's quick. He's very quick. Close, close combat. Impressive. Wow, this is cool. <sighs> wow. Ooh. Almost like leftovers, you know? That's where she kept attacking. We see them in the intro, no? Mm -hmm. I think so, yeah. 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 <gasps> this also looks a bit like the Matrix. You know, what are they called? The um... Sentinels? The Sentinels. Hey, looks like they kind of need to burn the corpse, you know? It behaves like a mushroom. You need to burn it. Yeah, it's a lot. Mm. It's great training if you think about it, no? Yeah. Mm. Oh my god, they need to revive someone! Wow. Uh Mm, Reno is doing a very good job. Oh, he's, yeah, he's doing good. He's like, damn it. Uh oh. Is it just me or is it a little too quiet here? And just the two of them? Something is gonna happen. <gasps> no, oh, it's this guy. Ah, uh, it's Boys, run! No! No. This was Kaiju number 8, episode 6. What yes. do you think? Such a good episode. Yes. Um, they're on the first mission. And they're all tired. But they're yeah, all fighting. They're, they're all still fighting. I mean, they're pushing through. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's a big mission, mm. right? For for this being their first mission, yes. like it's it's a lot. It's a lot. Yeah, yeah. But they're doing really well. You see, also, they are working well together. Although they're still rivals, right? There's still a rivalry between all of them. Uh, Kafka, of course, standard, <laughs> about to throw up. Uh, not able to really fight. You know, being knocked out, but then realizing actually, I'm gonna do what I do best. Right. True. I did think, I did find it a bit disappointing though, that after all the training and stuff, he's actually not able to do a little bit more, like to actually keep up with the others. But I think, to be honest, I think I don't mind it actually. I like it because it would also just be. Like almost every other anime where we can take solo leveling as an example, right? He he is a nobody, he's not talented, he's not good, but eventually he does get that this little extra or or you know this opportunity and then he starts leveling and becomes amazing and mm. super strong. And here we see it, Kafka got the same thing, right? Kafka is a kaiju and he has huge, huge powers. Yeah. But at the same time, he's still a loser, right? He's like clumsy. He's not great at fighting. His combat power is only 1%. He needed six minutes to clear the mission, the training last time. Yes. I like the fact that they're not just overpowering him, you know. He has the kaiju, the kaiju within him, which is already overpowered anyway. I like the fact that when he's human, he's still this clumsy human that mm. he was in episode one. But then still, he did amazing things. He found yeah, the he core. Did. He understood that they have re reproductive organs to the point where they were actually destroying the reproductive organs. And now at the end, we see... Kaiju number nine, he's like, oh, this is no good. Yeah. They destroyed the reproductive organs. How do they know? Yeah, you know? So true. Kafka, Kafka is actually the best in the in the defense force because because of Kafka, they're destroying the reproductive organs. This is huge if you think about yeah. it. You know? Yeah, that's true, I guess. As long as he can prove himself and impress 
the vice, the, the, the vice president, the, the, the vice, vice the admirals, yes, whatever. Yes, yes. Um, and he will pass <laughs> his probation. Yeah. Then yeah, all good. You yeah. know. Well, you know, I think we said it in, in one of the episodes earlier. When you when you have these sort of scenarios, you need to have some sort of support unit within your team. Yeah. You can't always just have these super fighters that are just fighting because here it shows you they can destroy the Honju, they can destroy the Joju, but Kaiju Nine can run around and revive everybody. Yeah. He can revive them all, but Kafka is actually destroying it. Like he's stopping him by 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 yeah. with, by using because, his knowledge. I mean, he he is a valuable player. Yes. Right. With all the knowledge he has, and yes. obviously he's helping them. Yes. Yeah. yeah. I think more, my point is more like if he gets attacked. Oh. Right? Like yes. something always can happen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like if he gets attacked, he needs to be able to, to actually defend. defend himself and you yeah. know. Which he without, can. without without transforming. The suit. Yeah, without yeah, yeah, transforming. Yeah. He can so. do it if he transforms, he can't do it as a human. Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. True, true, true. Yeah, and this is what eventually we will get to where he will be attacked and he probably has to defend himself and he will transform. Yeah. Right? Because or he is being attacked and he doesn't transform, but then his team is there to protect mm-hmm. him, one or the other. We'll yeah. see. But how unexpected to see Iharu and Reno run into Kaiju number nine. Yes. I, I expected maybe to see Kaiju number nine. I didn't expect them to run into him. Mm. That is worrying me because of how strong he is. Yeah, and I guess he was there again to kind of revive them yeah yeah but it's just like what's this agenda but also did you did you pick up when he said oh i i specifically designed or i specifically created you with reproductive organs where are they so it does look like he's not just reviving and and mutating them he's also creating them yeah so who is this who is this so as as much as the, the 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 anime moves quite quickly i find it also moves quite slowly in the sense that they're not giving us a lot of backstory, mm. right? Um, I did enjoy how strong um, is it Mina? What's her name? Mina is right. She the she she even had to say oh like gravity reinforcement, which made sense, you know. Yeah. Like the cannon with the, is with not the huge. Yeah. And her then, combat power is ninety six. Yeah, that was crazy. Expected though, expected. And then, how many shots did she fire? Six? I think so. In the end? She killed it with two. Yeah. And she... And then she's... Yeah. Because I guess she she knew that those little hon... What, what, no, what's the name? Not Honju. Joju. Joju's. That they would appear. Mm. So she wanted to destroy as, as, as much yeah. of the Honju as possible. Yes. Makes sense. Yeah. Makes sense. I also liked how the veterans of the Defense Force were all impressed yeah, with the new impressed. recruits. And then we had a little cougar moment. <laughs> she was thirsting of the boys. Oh, that's funny. Um, and uh, Shinomiya is quite cute, actually. And you, you can see how her character and her demeanor towards Kafka is, is changing. She's still annoyed at him, but she cares for him and she's worried for him. It mm-hmm. seems to me at least, right? Yeah. She keeps looking over, she's she checking in on him, how she like how he's doing. And I really like the fact that they gave Kafka the moment to shine where he was like, you know what, I'm gonna do what I do best. Yeah. And he started dissecting the, the kaiju and going literally through it and finding, okay, this is the core, okay, what's this? Reproductive organs. Yeah, and and even, the vice was even impressed. Exactly. He was impressed with him. And then we did see him in an action as well. Yes. Which was just, yeah. wow. It was cool. But what I also like is that they have such unique and different fighting mm-hmm. styles. One thing I actually thought is when Mina was up at that tower and she was preparing to fight, I thought as strong as she is, she is incredibly weak because she can be attacked super easily and super quickly. Yeah. Right? She has this super huge cannon. She's linked into it with that, with that mm-hmm. mask, which also means her vision around her is is uh, not the same. Like, she can't see as much what's happening around her. If, let's say, number nine would spot her, he could take her out quite quickly. So, actually, she needs to have a bit of backup, right, to protect her from when she does these crazy shoots, shootings. But I guess they they do have an eye on her, right? Yeah. All the people in the control center. They better. Right? They, They can see if something would approach, I guess. Yeah. 
Fun episode. Fighting. I'm sure we're going to continue with fighting next episode because yeah, again, sure. Iharo and Reno are now encountering Kaiju number nine. Mm -hmm. And not only, he's also transforming right in front of them. Yes. So, which also then, if they survive, which I'm assuming they will, um, he will need to look for a new disguise because now they know that he is part of the cleaning crew. Exactly. Right? He's disguising as, as, a, as a member of the cleaning crew. Can he then transform into a different I, I human so. so he looks different? Ma, I, think, I think so. Could you imagine transforming into a Defense Force person and actually sleeping and training with them? Oh my God, imagine. Yeah, and pretending like he's one of them. Yeah. I, could, I wouldn't be surprised if they do something like that. Super fun. Episode 6. We have a lot more on the channel. We are watching My Hero Academia, Demon Slayer. Everything is linked down below. Check it out. And we'll see you for the next one. Take care. Bye.